Caitlin Clark, ladies and gentlemen, are you kidding me right now? She had a historical game chat. Oh my goodness. Did she not go crazy? Did she not go crazy? She is the reason why WNBA is now exciting. She is the reason why people are making live streams watching the WNBA. She is the reason why the WNBA is getting talked about and how they're making money and making the profit, bro. Caitlin Clark dominated again, chat. She had a historical game tonight. 30 points, 8 rebounds, 6 assists, 7 three-point makes, 4 steals. The first player in WNBA history to reach those numbers in the single game. Caitlin Clark. Caitlin Steph Curry Clark is her. She's her. Bro, she is literally the most exciting basketball player I have ever seen from a WNBA perspective. Her ability, her range, the three-point shots that she was hitting. I'm talking about I'm watching the game. I'm looking at all them three-point shots that she's making. Contested, close up. You know, uh, um, multiple defenders onto her as well. It was insane. And it was, it was, she was so hot in the game, chat. She had this Steph Curry effect, bro. She was so hot in the game, bro, where they were running like a pin-down cross-screen action for her as well. And they left, uh, I think, Kelsey Mitchell open. From the three-point line, bro, on a strong side corner as well, bro. And, and and it led to an open three. Her gravity off the basketball. Caitlin Clark was really good off the ball tonight, bro. She was running off the pin down. She was coming off the curve, coming up on the screens. She was hitting shots. You can tell that having five days off really, really helped her as well, bro. Because you got to understand, when people sit there and say, Mookie, why doesn't Caitlin Clark look as dominant as she did um, in college? And I was like, bro, first of all, it's the system and the scheme. They didn't, they're didn't. they not allowing her to run that same system and scheme like she was doing in Iowa like they're doing in Indiana Fever. But also, bro, she's she's freaking gas. Bro, she played throughout the whole entire tournament in the WNBA. I'm not, I'm not WNBA, but the Women's Basketball College Tournament as well, right? And made it to the final two, right? And, um, you know, she lost. But like I said there and said, bro, she has literally asserted herself. She's been carrying her team. And um, Iowa as well. So she only had like what I would say two weeks of, of break. And then it was already draft time. And then it was already preseason time as well. She didn't have a full month of not playing basketball. And that does a lot of wear and tear on your body. So now she got five days of rest. She looked sharper. She looked quicker. She didn't look as gassed as well. And she looked dominant, bro. Um, Caitlin Clark is unbelievable. She's the face of the WNBA, right? She is one of the league's best players in the WNBA as a rookie. She's, if we being honest, Chad, she's going to win with rookie of the year. It's going to be unanimous. But she's arguably having the greatest rookie season of the WNBA of all time, Chad. She is that elite. She is that good. Shout out to Caitlin Clark, ladies and gentlemen, bro. She is her. She is her dominant. Dominant. Her playmaker, her IQ, her vision. And I'm going to tell you all something, too. If her teammates would catch the ball where she's – putting a pinpoint on the dime, on the money as well, and they missed the layup as well, Caitlin Clark would probably be uh, averaging 12 assists a game. 12 assists a game. She's that lead. Like I said, the said chat, one of the greatest players i ever seen. She has the most skill. Nobody has her range. Nobody can do what she do on that basketball court for any woman. Nobody can do that. No woman in the world have her range, bro. Nobody in the woman in the world have her three-point shooter. So where are you Caitlin Clark's hated? Caitlin Clark shut the haters up. Shut the haters and the doubters up. We talking about the game right now, bro. Why y'all can't talk about the game when we talking about Caitlyn Clark? Why y'all just talking about, oh, she's only doing this because she's white? No other white woman can do what Caitlyn Clark can do. Real talk. Y'all, come on, bro. Let, let's not do this stuff, man. Real talk. Y'all was out there praising Angel Reese for dropping 13 points. Like, who can do that? And Caitlyn Clark just dropped like 31 points. Come on, man. Let's get out of here, man. Shout out to Caitlyn Clark. Rookie of the year. And ladies and gentlemen, she keep on playing like this. If she keep on scoring 30 points consistently, she might challenge Agent Wilson for that MVP spot. I'll holler at y'all.